Yo guys, we're back with another video, and today's video is one that's very different from our past videos. Today's video is going to be walking through The Walking Dead. We're all going to play each and every season, including 400 Days, including the Michonne, Season 1, Season 2, every single episode. Hopefully daily videos, if not at least two every two days, or that is one every week. But without further ado, let's start. I'm going to try not to talk during the cutscenes, just so you can watch through the story with me. Uh, turn on... You know, I feel like I need hints, so we're gonna go with the standard. Um, no, 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 don't, don't worry, guys. We're gonna play episode one for you all. Episode one. So I think it's pretty easy to get a platinum trophy on this game. Uh, so all you need to do is complete each and every episode for each and every season and complete the full season, which I'm gonna do for you guys, anyways. This bundle was £30 on PlayStation for every season. Every episode, Michonne, 400 days, and there's some other thing included. If you like me to do some challenges on this, like, go through it again, but on a harder difficulty, like we saw before without any hints, or go through it choosing a different option than what I've chosen this time, then I will do. Our song sister series is good. Come and join here, five likes for this episode. A new murder day. A new murder fucking day. Whew, let's go, guys, let's go. Yo, there's me, there's Lee. Don't worry though, I have actually seen, I've watched through the full series twice, so well, I do know. I reckon you didn't do it then. I did, but I have seen, like, uh, what made you say that? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Um, not for me, because you're not going to get that from me, because I did it. guys in your position already said it enough. So yeah, I do know exactly what's going to happen. But don't worry, just for you, I'm going to act surprised. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. You're from Macon, then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? I got much choice? Sure don't. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Hey, the full game's installed. I don't know what that means, but the full game's installed, guys. I didn't even get to see what I was going to say. Now, I could have went with the f simple fuck you. But I think I'm going to try and be a bit nice. Make a few friends. Hopefully become the leader of the group, you know. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. I didn't he do was it. An older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses, and he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him, crying and snotting all over right where you sit. That would be me though. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. 
and I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Well, did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. Come on, kid. Watch the road. Watch the road. If I do say so. Fucking drive. This other time. Oh my motherfucking god! You already know we ain't smart enough. My ears, brody. My ears are bleeding a bit now. I think I should turn the master volume down. Just a tad for next episode. Just a tad. Just a tad bit. Oh fuck. Now I think I prefer to play this on PC because it looks to be easier on PC. And I did have the money for it on PC, but my recording thing me jigging on my PC is broke. So yeah, we all go got it on my PlayStation boys. Sacrifice my FIFA time for you all. So I hope you guys like the video. Uh, comment down below whether we should be fucked. Well, I don't know what for you to comment down below. I'll think of something later for you all. Thirsty. Ah, fuck my leg. Now the graphics on this game ain't that good, but we can live through it. Whoa, is that? Hey, my man's dead. Hey, officer, are you all right? I'm still cut back here. Looks like he got dislocated. Officer, leg. Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't a check. Nah, bro. Car. Look at his leg. Oh my God. Look at his leg. He's not moving. He must have the handcuff keys on him. He must have the handcuff keys on him. Yeah. Ooh, kick. 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 Damn right. I need to drag myself out that window. I need to drag need myself. To drag myself out that window. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Oh shit. <clears throat> Damn it. Damn it. <sighs> Come on, breathe. Come on. Nah, there's no way we're getting up there, mate. With the broken leg or whatever the hell I've got on my leg going, whatever the hell's going on my leg. I don't think this is where I'm getting up there. Come on, buddy limp. Use the car to rest yourself. Get your shotgun, get the handcuff keys, make a run for it. That's a nice number plate. He can't fall flat on his arse. I heard the crock a lock. Don't drop it. Easier to carry with these cuffs off. There's a shotgun shell there. I'm assuming we're gonna have to kill something. Officer. Come on, let us search his body. There's the keys. I touched his bum. Sexual assault, that is. Shit. Um, shit, shit. Our fingers. Uh, let us know in the comments if you'd like us to be more quiet than I am right now. If you'd like us to talk, if you'd like us to give my opinion on things. I honestly don't know what you'd want us to do. If you'd want us to talk less, if you'd want to take it seriously, if you want us to mess around and joke around. <gasps> shit. Now, I do remember watching this. I watched it like. When it first came out, like four years ago or whatever, 
Shit, I can't remember that. Get away from me. Uh... Nah, 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 nah. He's got no legs, it's okay. Come on, bit. I've got my Call of Duty skills ready. I swear, these butterfingers, boy. Dropping keys, dropping shotgun shells. I bet you both of them dropped, yeah. I try clicking R2 to shoot. Why do it gotta be X? Damn, I blew his face off. Now, if there's more out here, which I'm guessing there is, because what else would have killed him? Then. Help! Go get someone! Is that a little girl? Been a shooting. What? Course, you know, I'm a big fan of The Walking Dead. I've watched every single series. You know, I love it. Damn. I'm being chased by walkers. Now, uh, I'm home alone. I'm a big pussy when it comes to being home alone. And having these headphones on, which have an amazing volume. The volume being as hella loud as it is. I'm, uh, I'm pretty scared, I keep taking my headphones off to listen for people coming in my house, you know. I'm a scared cat like that. But yeah, there's a swarm or something, or a herd of you call them. Pop, 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 pop. Did I just jaywalk? Now I know this based in America, so I said jaywalk. And I'm not from America, so I don't know what the term jaywalk means. So that's what you can leave in the comments. Let me know what jaywalk means in the comments. Also, let me know what you do if you were in Lee's. I'm pretty sure his name's Lee, I can't remember. What you do if you were in Lee's situation. Would you be scared? Like, what would you do? I think there should be no shooting. Aye, shooting the drone, the zombies, I guess. Come on, Lee, pull yourself together. It's a tree house. I remember this tree house from the intro. Hello. Yeah, this is the golden room at the start. There was a swimming pool, there was a tree house. It's uh, pretty nice. What's this then? Cup of tea. One of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. I don't know what bourbon is. It's probably alcohol or something. Anybody up there? No ladder. <laughs> I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg, the way it is. I thought. Help! What? Surely it's gonna be someone in the house. If anybody's home. You wouldn't just. No matter. I thought the door was open. I was about to say you wouldn't just leave it open, now, would you? If you went home. Hello. Anybody home? Sounds Do much different. Help? Come on now. Let's boot the door down. Nope, not gonna smash it. It's gonna be the gentle old man and stop. Don't shoot, okay? <sighs> yeah, if this was England, you wouldn't be seeing don't shoot. You'd just be seeing I'm coming in. Give us all your money. If I really you just wouldn't be seeing don't shoot. There's not that many guns in England, to be fair. Hello? I think I'm gonna start having put screamers at the front. Or one of them. Oh, sorry, I'm keep talking when they is. People might need more help than I do. But there's subtitles so you can read what they're saying. When it's like people talking further on in the game, if we find anyone else other than people that people that live here, then I guess I won't talk. Give me some fruit, bro. It's fake. Damn. Jesus. Um, I heard something ringing. The phone, maybe. Um. Maybe there's something on there. Huh? <gasps> that Three beeping? new messages. Message yes. one left at 5:43 p.m. Okay. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. 
Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. I remember the name Clementine. Message two. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. I reckon the crazy guy is a zombie. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Damn. Father looks a bit like me, apart from the father looks far. Daddy? Huh? See, I would have thought the same thing. I would have thought it was my dad coming. What's this? Oh, there's a radio. Hello. Hello? You need to be quiet. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This yes, is that's my the girl. house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. How old are you? Eight. I sound a bit like a Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm uh thirty-seven. Okay. Thirty-seven. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? Hey. I can see you through the window. Yeah, she's just a little girl. So I'm gonna... oh, shit. She's just a little girl, so I'm gonna try and be nice to that. No, gotta be nice to the little girl. Lydia, she could have warned us instead of just screaming. My goddamn leg. Get punched, kid. Guys, Clementine. Come on, come on, save us. Go on. Go on. Come on, Clemmy. Just passes the hammer. Honestly, she passes the hammer. It's, it's okay, I'll protect you. Get on top of her. Ooh! Cave us, Scully. One for good luck. Another one? Huh? Yeah, the graphics don't seem to be too good for £30, but Man. honestly, I don't care. I love The Walking Dead. Hi there. Clementine? Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Uh, I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I'll look after as long as I can, that Clem. Might be a little while, you know. Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Good boy, Lee. Good boy. What should we do now? Yeah, well, we want to send quick. We need look to find help, help okay. before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. 
let's go. Let's Damn, she, she really trusts us. She's told Mahan already. I mean, if I saw some random guy in my house being turned up with a hammer like that, I would not be trusting them, no matter what they say. Boy, I'd be beating them up with a the hammer. Pick the hammer up, but then there might be more monsters out there. Yeah, stop all the monsters getting in your house. That's a good girl. What? Don't run away. No, did you not see my leg? I'll be limping all the way home. I think the girl was at the start. This is her. The one, you know, the one that asked for help and she ran away. Man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. Hello? Sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. It's hot dish night. <laughs> not after this, it's not. It's a barricade in your house, something I'm getting the hell out of here night. What's so the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Take the radio. I won't leave you alone. Let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Mate, if we can talk, we're not monsters. Or whatever he's calling. The one we're both gonna give us the chomp. What are you doing? Trying to get home. This neighborhood's a disaster. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. Clem, get behind us. I'm Chet. Chet to nonce. Stay she behind us. Open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family. She ain't my daughter, bud. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Her babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. Yeah, I think I should have said I'm just some guy. What do you want to do? I... Because now I've lied to her. Your monster's coming out. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Shouldn't. I mean... I prefer to be getting Clem in the house life rather than helping you do this, but I guess we can roll with this. Yes, Clem. Show them muscles. Clem I was gonna see if Clem can have something like he's getting in the that nuts. As babysitters go, I'd say your parents owe you a tip. I'm not a babysitter, sorry. Sorry guys, I'm just gonna, uh, what's it called? Turn down the master volume just a little bit. I'll put it... Put the voices on 10. And put the sounds to 7. That seems to be a good choice, and if not, we'll fix it. I'm probably going to end up putting the uh, sounds to probably five, voices to ten, zero music. I wonder where we're going. I think the taking route will form. Pretty sketchy though. Me and Clem time should have brought Wahama. So yeah, leave the comments down below where you went with these guys. And uh, do you think we should stay with them? Do you think we should try and leave? Do you trust them? Hey Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. So one of them's called Sean. And I don't know what the other one's called. But we're staying at Sean's, I guess.
Thank God you're okay. Wait, I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Um... Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well... Looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah. It's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Um, could be worse. It could That's be. What it sounds I have no like. luck. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Herschel. He's off the he's off the walking index season one, two, and three. Ask me. How'd this happen? Damn. Uh. Car accident. That so? Where are you headed? Before the car accident. Home. Where's home? I grew up in Macon. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? Nobody. Is that so? Yeah. It is. You said we. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there, and we're done here. Please and thank you. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we, uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. Now that's smart, Sean. That doesn't seem necessary. Okay, here's your show. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious... Shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We yeah, gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? Chop it off. I'll probably just have to shoot you. So I'm gonna chop we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Anyways. And tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. It is unfortunately. This is Herschel in the game. Herschel wasn't the original Walking Dead. Not Fear the Walking Dead. The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead. It smells like. But unfortunately. I know what it smells like. Unfortunately, he has passed this week at the age of 14, 79, I think it was. So, we just have a moment of silence for him. My mom and, dad. and then we'll put it at the end of the episode. And then we'll see you in episode 2 very soon. Pretty far. Oh, okay.
Hey, get up. I don't know if that was a minute or not, but I'm gonna end it with here. I'll see you very soon. Well, you slept Please in a barn, little lady. Enjoy. Lucky you don't have